You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Item provided by Kinex for review. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Excited to bring you a brand new set of the original Lincoln Logs America's National Toy. This is the Country Meadow Cottage. And I do want to say thanks to Kinex for sending us this cool set and a bunch of others to check out on video. It's 137 pieces and for ages 3 plus real wood logs made in the USA. Now there is a second build it looks like. I'm wondering if the instructions give you all the builds or not. There's two figures which I saw on the front. She's right here with the horse. And then I noticed on the back when I was looking at the box it looks like bottom half of the dress or skirt whatever you want to call that comes apart and then she can ride the horse around the cottage. All right, when I come back, I will have this out of the, ah, forget it. Let me just open it now. Dump it all out and then we will come back. Just so we can have that opening experience together. Like I said, I've got a bunch of other sets. So this is just the first one. We have the 100th anniversary collector set too, which is huge in a giant tin. Okay. Uh, lots of pieces. How about we just look at the instructions together right now and then I can study them slightly. Okay, so I have some decals. Nice, what looks to be a big sheet. Okay, so you can step one, step two for this. And then they show you how to put the house pieces on, roof pieces on. All the pieces there, and then after you get to step one, two, okay, so you're building the main building all the way up to step ten. So that's what I'm going to do. When I come back, I'll have my pieces out of the bag. Who wants to hear all this crinkling in your headsets if you got headsets on? I don't know. Some people like that sound. I'll be back a little more organized, and I will start building my meadow cottage. All right, I am back, and after I poured this bag out and got my pieces set off to the side, I thought, let me just pour this bag for you now, because I just like that Lincoln Log sound, you know? Remember that sound from Lincoln Log as you drop, dropped them out on the countertop or wherever you're playing? All right, so there's that. Now, here's the figure. There's multiple pieces here, and this thing is very skinny and small, so be careful with that, especially for the three-year-old because it is for three plus so make sure either you put that together for them or if you're not comfortable take that out of the set okay and then her dress let's see I don't know if there's a front or back let's see let's assume maybe there's a bow on the front no nope, the front and back look to be the same so it looks like it just clips in which that did so now she is set alright let me do this let me start with step one normally I like to set up a few steps. It's not going to be that hard to build, but I would like to organize this better. Looks disorganized, doesn't it? It's kind of neat the way they show you how they want it all to go together by the pieces, so for some reason I just don't remember that with other Lincoln Log sets, all the instructions. It was more you just do it and build it, but it's been a while, so maybe it's a change they made. Okay, so there is step one, and then step two here, I'll, maybe I'll do this side. I'll do step two. All right, no, hard to see with all the glare. That's why I want to reset everything up. But you're putting these triple stacks together on each of the points. So you're kind of building up the structure here. Or four. It's four on a stack. This kind of builds up where you could put probably windows in. Stuff like that. All right. One more set. It's kind of neat. I'm building my own cottage. And of course, you don't have to follow any instructions. You could build it however you want. All right, there you go. I will move on now to the next set of steps. Set up a little bit differently and come right back. All right, so here we are. I'm kind of at the angle. I wanted to show you off to the side how everything is just set up there. I have divided up. And I do want to show you that these pieces are plastic, so it's not 
all wood. The Lincoln Logs themselves are wood, and you have half pieces. You can see the difference there. So this would be a full round Lincoln Log, and that's half. Now the halves are what I put down on the base so it sits flat. So that happens in you know certain sections of your building. So the next steps I will show you over here. Look at that. So I'm working on step three, which is in the top left. Let me see if I can move this up just a little so we get it all in there. And then here is a window, and they show the window like this on this section here. And why it's like that is so that it locks in once you get the piece above it. So now the window will stay in place. So sometimes you do have to wiggle. All right. So now the window should stay there. And then now we need another one on the back here, and then another one along the side here, going this way. Now it looks like they don't put a window in this side, it only shows the one. And then a long piece will hold that all together, okay. That's all set, nothing going on up here yet. So now to match this, they want one on each end. Okay, it looks like we're building up now. So next step would be to put another one going this way. So we need some more halves, small ones this way. Okay, and then it looks like they have, the way they lay this out now, there's pieces down here that you need to put on before you put those pieces. I think that's what they're trying to show you there. So you have one going this way this way and then one in each of the points before you put the floor in there's like a or the ceiling I guess you would call it okay now the ceiling is some flats upside down see these these are the flats upside down and it looks like they go into here okay so now we have our second floor going on and this way Okay, and let's see, then one running along the back, and then another one here, okay, and then two along the sides. Okay, so there we go, that is working its way up. Now, step five in the back shows another set of the fours. Seems simple enough, doesn't it? Okay. So how many of you have played with Lincoln Logs? And would you enjoy a set like this? Would you have fun playtime? I was thinking I might do some stop motion at the end. I haven't decided yet. We'll see with my horse, you know, riding up. That might be fun, huh? Don't worry, I didn't forget the last one on that other one. Okay. Wow, this is a tall building. And now one across the back, like this. And the front, like this. That kind of locks it all in. See how it's going to lock in? And then another window is going to go in soon. That there. Grab another window. They show it this way. Okay. And then one across there that locks the window in. Now that's all set. And then two little ones here and here. So let me reset up, change my instructions around, come back, and finish building. Okay, here we go. Hope you can see the instructions good enough back there. And hopefully the camera is focusing on the right object and not on the back. So you're putting those on. And now you're sliding these over the little pegs there. And then you can just keep adding your pieces on. Okay. Let's see how this one locks in. Here's what the bottoms look like, by the way. So you can kind of see what's going on here. Looks like you can... Shift them if you want to make the roof line here. Look, actually, this one would go this way, I believe, to keep the top 
offset. So now it's offset. So it looks like how you gonna know how do you know which way is which every time? I don't know. I will just have to guess. So that will match. This doesn't match. If you look at this top piece, you've got a bigger than a smaller. So you want to stay opposite of that every time. So now the small is up there, so you want to turn the big piece up here. And I'll show you later how this all works out for the top. Okay, and then working our way down, ah, I guess that's the tricky part. So let's start it the same way. I don't know if that's going to work the same way. We will see. Or you need to be opposite. That's one of those little detail things that not necessary. You can put them on any way you want to put them on. And then the decals go on the top, so I can do that after. Okay. Almost closing it off. And the last one. That actually worked out good. I like that. So those line up going this way. I'll show you in a bit. Here, I'll tell you what. Let me, since that's all set now, the next is the front. So let me rework this here. Come back. Show you the, turn the roof around so you can see it. And then we'll continue building. All right. So here's the top so you can see it from this angle. And now you see how the shingles are together. Here, I'll show you a close-up here. It might be easier just to do this. This would be correct in regards to how shingles are put down. This would be incorrect. So lining them up would not look right. Okay, so that's why I was paying attention to that today. Glad I didn't miss it. I could have built the whole thing and then realized later, huh, I wasn't paying attention. But like I said, it's not the end of the world. Okay, and then a couple of these. So now what we're building is step eight here. It's this little front piece that's going to go just line up. It doesn't look like it connects. Hey, connects. Okay, so that's that. And then now step nine. There is uh, fours. Okay, looks like we're going through all the pieces. One... go we're getting there it'd be nice to have a log cabin cottage wouldn't it I guess you can imagine while you're playing that it's your log cabin cottage well it looks like we're going to use almost every piece this is all I have left of these Let me tilt this down a little And the colors on these, they're all, you know, it's wood, so they're a little bit different. Like this one here's got a little piece taken out, but they seem really smooth. They're nice to touch. It feels like plastic, like it's got a nice coating on it. All right, now these. All right, so I want the window in. And then the doorway. Here's the doorway. I had to put this in, so that was on two little pins that popped in there. I always like putting in the doorways. It seemed cool that it would lock in like that. And then another this way. Okay. And then another this way locks it in. That closes the door down. And there you go. I'm gonna reset up now, flip the instructions, and move on to the next set of steps. Okay, so the last few steps, and then they want you to apply the decals so that's there and now we're doing another section for the roof area now remember you can put these on any way you want I'm gonna follow what I've been doing and Almost done. I was just thinking too when I went away for a second there. I think the fun part of Lincoln Logs 2 was smashing it all down. 
I don't know why, just knocking it over after it was built, but I'm not going to do that. I just remember that being fun. All right, so we are set. Let me come back. The decals now, they show some on the pieces here, like you pull this piece out and you put these on here. Let me do a few here and then I'll finish them up because it's just easier to apply these carefully later. So they show them, let's say, on this piece and then going across the top as a decoration for your cottage. See, never seem to go on straight when I want them to go on straight. So that's why I like to take a little bit more time with those. So I'm going to do that. But that's how you would do it. And then you have a squirrel and an owl. And there's little decorations that can go on. So I'll do, do those off camera. Come back and then I'll show you when it's all done. Alright. I couldn't stop the camera. I figured why not show you a few more and just put them on and hang out together. So they have a window all the way up here. I'll fix them later if I want to straighten them out. It doesn't have to be perfect anyway. And they have one going along here on this piece. Okay. Plus, I turned it a little. That does make it easier to try to get these on. And they have here. This one I'll take off because it's just hard to reach over there. And then I will put this on. Here we go. Easy enough. I do want to get the squirrels on there for sure. Okay. And then remember which way this was. It was like this. Okay. So now it's starting to take shape. There's some squirrels on the rooftop. So I'm going to make sure I'm not in the middle of one of these. Okay, he's hanging out. And then there's little mice. Hmm. Where do I want my mice? I don't know if I want mice on my rooftop, but yeah, we'll put them on there anyway. Let's just say they're hanging out here right by the door. They greet you as you walk into your cottage. Another squirrel up here. He's way up on the top. Hanging out. And then there's an extra strip here, but the well, maybe I'll put it up top here. It might balance this out. Let's see if I can take this one out. I'll have to readjust that. Here, I'll just do this. Okay. I'm way down here. Sorry, horse. Okay, squirrel is set. And then this is going to go this way. And then this one's back on. Get in there. Okay, there we go. How's that? Looks pretty cool, huh? Then I just have a few more accent ones. You know, maybe I can, uh, well, let me put an owl on the side here. Come on over to the side if you got your headphones on. Now you hear me better over here. Okay. And here we'll put... I got a couple of these. Hmm. Well, let's put them up here. They kind of show them around the window area here. Just kind of on a... Ooh. Put too much pressure on that. Get up there. There you go. It's about to lose it all. That's the thing about Lincoln Logs. They don't really lock together. So you're going to have movement and things will come apart. Okay. There is my cottage. I will come back now, get everything cleared out, move the instructions, and we will take a closer look from different angles. All right, here we go. I moved it to my spinner so you can kind of get a better, easier view of everything. I can just do this. Look at that. Ooh. Pretty cool. Did you see there how the logs kind of have like a glow to them when the light hits it so they have a shiny feel to them? And then I will change the angle here. We'll get a little bit lower and closer in so you won't see the whole uh, cottage but you'll see a little more detail inside you can see all the way through how about a top-down view so we can see what it looks like from the top pretty cool camera up I did mention stop motion, so maybe I'll do a little quick one here with my one character and my horse as they come home, or maybe we... Uh, let me figure something out. 
I'm going to move it back to a surface that doesn't spin because it's hard to do any kind of stop motion on objects that move in regards to trying to keep things you know as stationary as possible so I will be back with that what a beautiful day oh no not rain there that's better Okay, Simba. We gotta get to town. It's an emergency. We need medicine for Papa. Let's get to the barn so we can get ready. We have so much to do. Oh, this rain. Simba, it's horrible. You're definitely getting some extra apples today. Let's go, Simba. Oh, steady, bro. It's okay, it's okay. This won't take long. Come on, giddy up. All right, there you go. Hope you enjoyed the video. I had fun putting it all together for you. And like I said, there is a bunch of other sets for Lincoln Logs that we have from Connect. So as I get to those, we will be adding the videos to our channel. And if you're a fan of Lincoln Logs and you play with them, let me know in those comments. And of course, as always, and I say it every time, there are more videos related to this type of video in our description. We'll have a link there. Or as always, you can just go to LuckyPennyShop.com and search for Lincoln Logs. Later! If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh yeah, please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up. Thanks for watching. <laughs>